Hello, Lulas. Welcome, welcome, welcome back to my channel, guys. Guys, if you're not subscribed to this channel, go ahead and smash that subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Also, guys, make sure that you click the bell to be a part of the notification squad. And if you haven't joined the chat box, the link is in the description bar. You do have to be at least 18 years or old. Ugh, wait, you do have to be at least 18 years old or older to join. It is $1.99 a month for an exclusive live stream once a month where we connect and do doll chat and interaction uh, videos. So, um... What else was I going to say? Oh, yeah. And if you want your merch, you can also see the link in the description bar. But in the meantime, in between time, I am here with baby Nigel. And as you can see, he's still wearing the same little outfit that he's had on for a while. But I'm just going to put him in a little shirt and diaper. And I'm not sure if I'll keep his socks on or not um, to go with the outfit. I mean, not outfit, but for the night but I wanted to tell you guys that I have been on a huge nesting 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 spree and also I've been on a kit oh sorry and I've been on a huge kit spree too shopping spree I um have realized that it is so many different faces out there and I know I tend to like to repeat the same kits over and over again but I said you know what I want to paint something different I want to paint you know of course I still will paint my classics like I do plan to still paint me another chase I do um have my Gabigales that I want to still paint you know again because you know as you change and you grow um with your painting i just like to see the difference in what they look like now versus when i did it before type thing but um yeah i so i i, I found like a whole bunch of different faces so i have quite a bit of new faces coming to um you know what i always hate trying to it's just usually easier for me to just flip them over and unsnap this but i have so many um new sculpts coming um that i will be painting and i can't, I can't wait um it's just it's just gonna be so much fun trying to see what the new ones look like and all that and stuff um the only thing that's different that i'm learning um sorry i keep saying um but the only thing that i'm learning that is different from you know when you paint a different sculpt uh you just different vinyls and stuff like that is different the paint takes different so you know some colors that you normally use on, you know, one one type of vinyl may not just work for the other one. Yeah, man, it's so, I'm so sweet. <laughs> Sometimes I get so frustrated. Like, I had one kit, I promise y'all, I just put it to the side. The vinyl was just, like, soaking up the paint. Like, I mean, put about 30 layers in and you still look like... You, you just put the first one on. I, I can't. That gets me really frustrated. And I hate the peachy vinyl. That drives me insane. I don't even want to paint those. But I have painted them. But I really hate painting the peachy vinyls. Um, but yeah, so I'm really excited. I have been nesting crazy, crazy, crazy. Uh, for my baby girl though so I've been I didn't even realize I was talking to a friend today and I was looking through you know what I'm expecting as far as you know like shipments and stuff like that and it's like man it's like I'm still expecting a package 
Um, it's only one company that I order from that has been really taking a while for the stuff to come. Um, everybody else has been shipping fairly quickly. But I've, because I've been like shopping for buying little stuff for my grandbaby and also for babies that I am going to be selling that's going to have to go home because I'm trying to get ahead of it and, you know, shop ahead of time because you can't really go in the stores like you used to. I used to go like after the doll is finished, I know what skin tone they're going to be and what colors might look good against them or what they little, you know, what I see would be cute for them as far as going home stuff. But I can't do that anymore. Um, so I've been trying to order stuff in. And I mean, it's been pretty good in a way because it's got me away from the same places that I used to shop like all the time. Now I'm actually looking at different stores and I, I buy from different stores now. So that's been a good thing. You need your hair done so bad. But I don't know. What kits are you guys like expecting or excited about getting at this moment? Um, I can't name, I can't name the kits right now that I've ordered because I'm just gonna, I just want to paint them and, you know, as they come in and as I, you know, get to them and just kind of surprise you guys. And plus with the, the baby adoption thing that we're going to be doing game, I don't want to name, miss a name, the <laughs> A kit in case I decide oh I don't want to do this one as a giveaway I want to do this one as a giveaway I don't want to I don't want to decide I don't want to tell you guys what kit it is <laughs> well um, but I will decide and I will tell someone what the kit is that's not going to be participating in the game um, ahead of time probably so that you guys will know that I didn't like rig it to fit the person or whatever I don't know I'm always trying to make sure the game is fair just because like I said for me I never felt like I had a fair chance with giveaways and stuff like that so I I try really hard but you know it's never going to be like, you know, everybody's going to still think there's a different way to do it. But we're going to have fun with it. I think so. Where is your little... Oh, I always forget these things. These snaps, like the little snaps in the, the middle. Oh my God, it's just so crazy. So, so crazy. Love, love, love. You look good in blue. I don't think it's like no color that he doesn't look good in. I I don't know. Maybe I'm not that excited about him in white. I don't think. I'm trying to think. Have he wore white that I really... I don't know. I like him in colors because, I don't know, I guess to me it just brings out... The skin tone more okay so let's do something with your hair let's oh my goodness I don't even be knowing what to do with his hair half of the time I don't know why where for some reason, I can never figure it out. I know it's really curly at the top. It's fuller at the top and then his little size, but I don't know. It's like I haven't figured that out yet. 
know I have my certain styles that I like to see his hair in. But with Nigel, it's kind of like, I don't know, messy hair is usually the thing for him. <laughs> I don't know. I got to figure it out. Let's see. Oh, my goodness. All right. <laughs> he just cracked me up. It's like he has this puzzle look sometime. And then it's kind of like a please pick me up type look. Okay, so I think I am going to put his socks back on. Yeah, I know. He's going to wear socks forever. Although I love to see his little pigglies. <laughs> I do love to see him wear his socks on. So I'm going to put his socks back on. And then we're going to go to bed. He's going to go in his bed and I'm going to go in mine. Right? I'm going to show, um, hopefully, I'm hoping, I don't even know what today is. By this weekend, I will finish, have my Dwayne finish, and I will be halfway finished with another sculpt that I am working on. And I haven't decided if I'm, I think I'm going to. I originally bought the kit for me to keep, but I think I'm just going to put it up for sale because I think I just enjoy wanting to paint them. So I'm kind of going through that phase too, to where I'm just enjoying being able to paint them. I can't keep them all. I have right now like zero space. I don't even know what I'm going to do when the new baby comes because I really don't have any space right now. Like, I don't even have space. I have babies in my closet in the nursery, and I don't even have space in there to add another baby. I have, let's see, one, two, three, four, five babies on the changing table, laying across the table, ta changing the table right now. I have one, two, three, four, four babies in cribs. And I have two in the swing, and then I have babies in my room. It is a bit much. <laughs> like, I am definitely needing to um, slow down on my personal collection, and I'm definitely needing to, um, to figure it out, like, different places of how to you know pose them and display them because like I said not all of them are babies that I change regularly dress regularly or anything like that it's just some I just really just love seeing out and just posed but I, I am running out of space big time my little sweet little Evie which is Lucy I'm enjoying her. I am so tempted to to get Charlotte by Laura Lee Eagles and paint paint her too because I I I am really liking the little ones, the little small newborn babies and stuff. They're just so cute. But um, yeah. So anyway, guys, thanks for watching. And again, I would love to hear what kits you are excited about. I know there's a lot of them out there. Um. A lot of different new sculptors popping up 
Um, so that's interesting to say the least that we just have so many tons of options now. So that's pretty cool. So anyway, guys, see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye now.